my members, I'm here with Jim Morrison. He is our latest artist in residence. Thank you for joining us today, Jim. Nice to be here. Thanks for inviting me. Of course. Um, so we've got some of your beautiful art here today. So tell me, when did you start painting? I was thinking about that, and I think I started so early. I don't even remember when I didn't paint. I've always painted. I've always been fascinated by art. I used to go to museums or people's homes and the thing I wanted to look at was paintings. I wanted to see if I could figure out how they did it. So I'm basically self-taught. So self-taught, curious child that's, you are. That's the syndrome, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what medium are we looking at today? These are all acrylics. Um, I have started using acrylics when I moved into Trilogy because they're easier to work with, they're easier to clean up, and they won't be offensive to people that are in the art studio. That makes sense. I used to do oils almost exclusively, and then I did do some uh, watercolors. But I, I kind of like the acrylics because they do dry fast. They're harder to blend, but uh, that's what these are, everyone. And Jim, let me ask you, what is your inspiration or motivation before you, do you start working on pieces? With, the, with these, these are all abstract, with the exception of the landscape. Um, and I, my inspiration is simply, I, I take the canvas, and I get paint, I put it on the canvas, and, and I listen to music, and I just let it go. And I, I stop when I think it's clear. I know that sounds silly, but... Not at all. It, but if it's not clear, then, then I, I keep going until it is, or I start over. So Jim, the most important question I have for you right now is, are these pieces available for purchase? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what's the best way to reach you if somebody um, wants to know about one of these pieces? All my cards are there with my phone number and my email. There's a price sheet right there. All right, folks, so please stop by the Outfitter and check out Jim's amazing work. And like he said, if you want to know more about any of these pieces, please reach out to him on one of those cards that he's provided here in the Outfitter.